My name is Connor Terrio, and I'm a BIM Technical Specialist here at Red Cage Solutions. Today I'm going to talk to you about a quick Revit tip that involves aligning your views onto your sheet. We're going to look at our floor plan views today. I'm going to come here, add, add a floor plan level 1 to this sheet, and I'm just going to place it here. Also going to add floor plan level 2 to the next sheet. Now right now, these two views are clearly not in the same spot on your sheet, right? Common question I have is how can I align these views to look in, like they're in the same spot on every sheet? To do that, we want to come up here to guide grid under the view tab and we're going to name this floor plans because this is the guide grid we're going to use to align our floor plans now it'll come in as a big large grid we want to shrink that down to one point, similar to this. And this is the uh, reference point that we'll use to align all of our floor plans. Okay, and we're going to place that somewhere there. Now, when selecting your view to move it into place, uh, items that you can select while you're on the sheet are your grid lines. Uh, reference planes, if we had them in here, or level markers. For the purpose of this demonstration, I'm going to use the grid lines, so the corner of A and 1. I'm going to select my view, type in MV for move, pick my point, and align it. That's sheet 1. Now on sheet 2, I have a problem. I don't see my guide grid. So as long as I'm still in sheet view, I'm going to click off into space and click in case I have my view selected, click off into space. In the properties menu, I'm going to scroll down, find guide grid. This currently says none. So for this sheet, no guide grids are showing. We want to see floor plans. There now it appears. And now I can move my floor plan to the correct location. Now if I look back, both floor plans are in the same spot on both sheets. That's a quick demo on how to use guide grids.